cool. Um, but yeah, mm-hmm. there's 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 people. There's some. Ian is like, oh, the meta is stale. This this game is figured out. I'll I'll just prove everyone wrong that it's like actually a shitty PvP Ooh. game. So I'm like, we need to kick his ass. He's like the villain. We absolutely need to beat him. So mm-hmm. like. I want everyone else to like go beast mode on him. <laughs> <laughs> I hope he I hope he gets destroyed. <laughs> mm. Game is figured out and then you pull out uh Brachus Gareth. Uh, yeah, exactly. And then he out. loses. That that would be that would be like that would be so good. <laughs> so who picks first? Uh, you, uh bans? You. Uh, Naz bans first and then and then Dadding. I ban Arhu. Fuck that guy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> True. Um, hmm. Who should I burn? I burn Shah. Okay. Yeah. And who picks now? Nah, it's first pick. Okay, first pick, huh? And then Diding will get two. Alright. Hello. Alright. No uh-huh. brackets? I already did Brackus Dallas. Yeah. Did Brackus twice. <laughs> Fuck that guy. I already <laughs> proved it up. <laughs> oh, that no, provoke, man. Melody, but... That provoke. I, oh, yeah, provoke is stupid. Yeah. <laughs> mm. And the third one, huh? And the third one. Ever. Who is it gonna be? Who is it gonna be? We we need to have an agreement on this right now, uh, regarding the charm exploits and the shield swapping, like between you two guys. What do you want to see happen yeah. and not happen? Because it's a bit too late, like mid game, if someone does it. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't want to like charm exploit shit. That's that's a little bit so, too much. Yeah. Right. Okay, so so, yeah. so charm, I'm fine with. No, so nothing. If you charm someone, you don't interact with them at all. Uh, but you're okay with like swapping scrolls for for the moment, right? Like that's sort of right now. The, the tournament allows like using other characters' scrolls. That's fine. Yeah, I um, guess. And, since it's already. Yeah. And, yeah. and, and lastly, just what about what about swapping weapons and shields? Because like so far, there's no rule against it. I assume that it would be legal, um, but the meta mm-hmm. might evolve around that. Uh, like your Tarquin could have a shit ton of uh, armor. Uh, so how? Nah, do you- I don't. I, I personally no, I'm not gonna do it. But if you guys want to do it, like yeah, go for it. Okay, I can cool. go with it. That works. So you're free to do it, uh, Dadding, if you wanna experiment with that. Oh wait, you you picked. All right. Yeah. Uh, who's gonna be my last? To be fair, slain without a shield is not too bad, but Gareth without a shield is fifty magic armor. It's it's yeah, kind of pathetic. He's like yeah. One one the deck from the yeah. from CC. So. Yeah, he he's just right next to CC Town. So I'm going Exenda last. Okay. <clears throat> All right, have a good match, guys. I'll let you. All right, uh, I'm gonna deafen. Yep. Yeah. Good luck. Good luck, man. Your best. Right. Mm-hmm. All right, <laughs> you know I was uh, I was very excited because you pulled out the uh, Malady Redeka, and I thought it was gonna go Brachus for the funny. Yeah, because <laughs> this is like the exact same scenario. Yeah, no, he's he's done. I'm telling you, Naz, because I don't know if you know anything about him, but he's a streamer, and he like at this point he streams the game, um, on honor mode modded because the game for him on honor mode is like too easy at this point where he has like randomizers that makes the game more unpredictable monsters have different effects um and he he just failed his run on the last boss last time and it's it's just bonkers it's just it's just really like <laughs> it you know when honor mode is too easy for you like what the hell <laughs> so um yeah he's wild yeah. um yeah. He, he just he's just not it, it just feels like you know like the time zones are kind of screwing him up. Like he's really tired right now, and like he I, he doesn't want to stress too much about it. You know, he's just kind of doing whatever. Um, but it turns out that it, it felt like the last set. He he wanted he didn't want to lose that set. You know, <laughs> so like yeah. he, he almost did, and he didn't want to. So like 
uh, I think now he realizes, like, no matter how tired he is, he doesn't want to get just kicked out for no good reason. So he's he's gonna draft properly, I think. And even if he's not fully focused, he's 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 gonna play. He's gonna play well. So I'm I'm quite yeah. excited to see this. There's um, a lot of rubber banding happening on uh, Dadding's end. Yeah, yeah, there is. Hopefully, it doesn't cause any issues with him uh, casting some spells. Uh, it might uh, just be the. I... Oh, you, you think that's in game two or just the Discord? It seems to be affecting it. Yeah, you can see the, like the icons rubber band, and like sometimes the characters will move, like their animations will play for like three seconds and then stop. That's not. That's not just like maybe the video going back. Uh, nope, I don't think so. I'll look I, at I the could clock. be wrong. I look at the clock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. If you look at the clock timer, it went back from fifty-one yeah. to fifty-two to fifty-one. So it's it's just his. Uh, yeah, this is a little bit painful. Uh, I guess we we can ask Naz uh, to stream it after this. Yeah. Um, Again, I I'm really sad that he didn't do the ex exact same thing that I did to him. Because uh, it would have he could have just kidnapped Tarquin here. Um, oh yeah 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 yeah. yeah. Just annihilated him, um, but he uh, I guess he doesn't have any sort of real CC is a problem with his build. Um, well, honestly, now that Sucker Punch is becoming popular, I think you have a uh, just uh, Malady deal enough damage, and then everyone can just dis like, well, Redeka oh, yeah. can equip just one one and, and Sucker Punch, but other than that, it's true that. See, actually having a staff is, is, is detrimental where you can't sucker punch with it. Oh, that's interesting. I'm seeing this skill get more plays now, and it's I, I would never see that a few days ago. No one used it. So. I think it's a bit preemptive, though. Um, one quality that they do... Well, actually, no. I don't know where Lohar is in the on the map. It's kind of hard, so he's probably going to scout did for it. Did he cloak? Yeah. I don't think he. Oh, did he close already? I think he did. Yeah, you only see two red dots on yeah, the map. Yeah, that's true. So he cloaked. No, <laughs> I wasn't aware that the German word for wet was nass. <laughs> yeah, I saw that. <laughs> yeah. I, I've been playing a lot of like World War Two RTSs lately, so it's kind of funny to see on the VODs so, like a Panzer in a different context because <laughs> it just means armor. Okay, I see. Yeah. Um. But yeah. Oh, wow, Naz is really taking this his, his time this time. La last game, it felt like he was... Ah, uh, not really. You know, he was thinking as well. Gareth is the thinking man's hero. Yeah. You know? <laughs> I can't let my allies die. <laughs> I'm a good guy. <laughs> okay, they, they really should have put the Searing Daggers uh, Ice Shard combo <laughs> in Gareth, because that would have been really fucking funny. <laughs> oh. That I think he was hoping for the uh, ricochet from the oil barrel. It did, no. I don't think it worked out quite the way he wanted. I think it, it bounced on one person. I think it hit Redeka, no. Oh, did it not? not no. Oh shit, that just, just... Yeah, I've I've tried to get those bounces before as well. I, it it uh, just seems to hit the barrel and no more. And maybe the range is small, but I feel like I don't know. Sometimes the bounce reaches pretty far. I guess he did spawn on that side, so he wouldn't have been able to. Um, kidnap anyone. He wouldn't have had the range. No, well, you can nether swap. For sure. True. I mean, I don't, I, I'd feel very uncomfortable with, uh, ult, with teleporting one of my guys. Uh, oh, no, no. The, the, the thing the you can do yeah. is that you can nether swap with a corpse, actually. These count as, like, targets for, for oh, nether really? swapping, yeah. So, uh, yeah. you just get them next. To, well, you're kind of giving a free source to the enemy team, but you're getting, uh, you're just throwing a body on their side and and bringing their their dude over here. So it's yeah, a I need to there. I need to learn the maps because I don't really know what where all the placements are. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I I have a I, I there's a lot of documentation that I'm gonna try to update. I guess in the Discord, a lot of well, I, at least Saber told me I could make a more detailed guide about the maps. Um, but I mean, it was kind of tedious because at first I really just used the data out of every map. Now, maybe if I make guides, I'll just focus on the legal ones. I'm not sure. Um, yeah. or maybe other people will, will, will eventually help me out. 
but yeah it would be pretty practical to have like where each person spawns like player one player two like uh, you know in the in the pick order because it's actually part of the pick order sometimes where uh yeah where your character spawn oh we uh, had some really sure. uh interesting plays earlier uh we had um Erratica that was out of his armor. Uh -huh. uh, Strong did that. And he um, jellyfish skinned his Radica. And the spider hit the Radica. It produced blood because Radica was, was, you know, armorless. And then she bled electric water, electric blood. And it stunned, the spider stunned itself by hitting Radica. So it cost her one AP to just immune herself. From the, the the like threat of the spider, it, it yeah. was it was I didn't that was just really clever and apparently that's something Strong did in his uh, campaigns and I was like wow I never paid attention to those spells at all. <laughs> so, uh, so I uh, yeah I, I was also looking back at the vod to to see what the commentation was and I uh, admittedly made a lot of mistakes and one of them was I, I should have used because uh, I had a similar scenario where I was getting bodied by a a bone widow okay yeah with Rodeca, right and uh it, i don't know if you remember this but i tried to do like a blood rain and then a, a electric discharge combo because uh the blood on the floor would electrify and stun them mm -hmm. but it would have just been way better to do that yeah make my use the jelly fins yeah i didn't electric. i didn't even know it did that now now i know yeah <laughs> so we're, we're discovering a lot of cool plays to do that's uh yeah i mean this strong strong makes me want to play Rodeca really bad, and then and now that I've seen the shield potential, I I, I kind of want to play that shielded Rodeca, you know. <laughs> How worth it is the armor? Because I figure you have to spend uh, a, a decent amount of AP like nope. equipping the shield, and then you have to use shields up to get the armor. Oh, it's three AP total. Yeah. yeah. This is a pretty good play. I like it because. Uh, Tarquin doesn't have any mobility, so he's just going to be very sad for the next couple of turns. And uh, this is one of the things that I love about DOS 2, is um, just the ways you can influence the environment. I'm not, I'm not super um, well-versed in different art, uh, RPG games, but like, uh, for example, I was playing uh, DOS 1 uh -huh. earlier, and it was just really frustrating because uh, the the terrain manipulation just isn't quite at the same level. Okay, yeah. Yeah. What what brought you to play DOS 1, actually? Just curious. Uh, well, I, I just come off fresh, fresh off the heels of winning my first uh, DOS 2 campaign, so I was like, yeah. Oh, okay, okay, I see. Did you touch yeah. uh, Baldur's Gate 3 at all, or you're going to wait for the full release? We might have talked about this already, actually. Uh, I don't think we have. Uh, I'm going to wait for the full release. Okay. See, yeah, I'm not I'm not a really big fan of buying a game and then, like, waiting a couple of months for the next update, and then yeah. like, I, I prefer just buying finished games. Yeah, for, same same for me. I, I yeah. it, it was... Sometimes it's tempting because it looks really cool when you look at gameplay and stuff, but I try not yeah. to look too much and just say, it'll be a great game in a while, and then I'll be really lucky yeah. to play it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> also, it's because uh, my computer's getting to be a little bit old, so and I'm planning on upgrading it at some point, so it would be nice to... Uh... Or what's his face? Like, Baldur's Gate seems like a very... Um... Inten um, a resource intensive game. Oh, okay. So I yeah, want to yeah, be yeah. able to see it when it's at like full fidelity, max uh, visual fidelity, I guess. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it looks like yeah, a really pretty game that you would want to to run uh, at fairly high settings too. I'm not really sure what this play is. It, it does get rid with the uh, the blood totem. Yeah. But it also puts Tarquin in a semi-relevant position. Yeah, I don't know. Well, I mean, Malady can knock him down soon. True. Uh, oh. Oh. Uh, well, oh. 
Is that a... Yeah, he Rupture probably, tendons? He probably stacked all the AP he wanted here. Uh, he Apparently gets, adrenaline is the same. Sorry. He gets his next uh, turn after Rodeca. Oh, he's gonna and web. Oh, uh, oh she's How heading. Is the... Oh shit. She's heading into the water as well and everything. <laughs> um, damn, that's like an, a, a guaranteed kill. I it, it's kind of strange because when I use uh, you know yeah. the that combo. It um. They always just stop moving, but maybe that's because I spec uh, opportunist as well. Yeah, I think if there's uh, if there's any reason that that's why I feel like they've made the AI too smart now, where it really um makes a lot of plays just kind of not work. It's like the the AI just doesn't want to let it work, and it is just underwhelming sometimes for me. The the up, the most obvious example is uh, definitely uh, Haunt. Haunt is just so bad now. It's just so bad. Yeah. Like, you taunt someone and they do, like, something better than you would have. You, that you didn't think of, you know? Like, why would you even... <laughs> uh, but earlier, especially, Naz, like, had... He taunted a character. And the character he taunted, it was, like, a, I think it was... Um... So, he used Brachis to taunt... Uh... Tarquin, and Tarquin used di like the disease on Slain. What the fuck? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and it's like I think it's because uh, Brachus himself had uh, Chackles of Pain on him. But uh -huh. what is Taunt even for then? You know, like what the? What and like the I fuck? guess the logic is maybe that like. It can bounce on him, sort of, but like, what the? Anyway, so it, it was. Um. Oh, he ran out of time. Oh, that didn't. That didn't figure. Out. Yeah. So. Yeah. So I. I don't Man, know. Man, that was. A... So a couple of things. Um. What does cursed web do? I don't entirely remember. I know that blessed web gives you haste. Uh, cursed web does. Uh, I don't know exactly what happens if you walk into Curse Web, but I know for a fact that if you are not, it's really weird, okay? If you're not affected, I'll do the whole sequence. Let's say you end web someone and you curse the web on the same turn, okay? It mm -hmm. doesn't do anything, literally, okay? Okay. If you web the person and then next turn they lose their end web, but they're, you know, like, they're in web for the turn, and then their turn ends. So the in web leaves, but they're still in place. If you curse it after that, they get a first in web sort of debuff. It's just called in web, but it has two turns of in web. You're in web there for two turns in a row. It's kind of yeah. like the, the cursed freeze, I guess. The cursed uh, double double chill into double freeze stack. Um, yeah. So I, I didn't understand that combo at first because you need to wait for the initial in web Status to be gone to apply like the, the super and web status i guess um but it is in fact really nasty it's it's a two turn uh two turn in web that can only be removed through uh um burning really yeah i was actually thinking maybe you could pull some shenanigans like um lohar has pretty high initiative so you could web uh you could web bless your team? Yeah, I don't know it's, how... it's been done. It's been done, actually. Been done. Um, yeah, I always thought, like, the play was just to go ahead and, and web the enemy team, you know? But, uh, actually, yeah. Saber, early on, everyone was like, Lohar's busted. And I was like, oh, yeah. And he's like, yeah, I want to web your team. And I'm like, what the hell? And then he webbed his own team and then dropped the smoke on it and then blessed the smoke and the web. And what <laughs> In that, his haste? You, you oh, have, my God. You have haste and invisible for your whole team. Yeah. Um, he says that if you do it pixel perfect... Uh, you can actually do that without in webbing your team. They get hasted without being in web. Um, so maybe that's something that would be worth exploring. If we, I mean, is that even really an exploit that you can plan or not? Oh, over. Yeah, it's it's over. Yeah. Quite unfortunate. 
Ah, I missed played a bit. Was Hello? Bit <laughs> it, was, hey. it was like, I wonder how this is gonna go, and then Lohar appears and it's like, oh, well, Redeka doesn't exist anymore, yeah. that's rough. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And it was so unlucky she went the other way. Uh, yeah. yeah. Well, it's just, it's kind of weird when sometimes they go really far and sometimes they don't walk yeah. as much. And from what I understand, it depends on um, the threats that they look at. They don't want to go towards even more danger. Um, mm -hmm. So it's, I guess we'll learn how to condition the AI, but I don't know. In that case, she just ran all the way. <laughs> she, she ran for, yeah. she ran for her death, really. <laughs> I lost like 3 AP and 91% hit chance. That was fun. That was yeah, like, I saw it. <laughs> I was like, yeah, okay. That was that was cool. All right, maybe the next 91 is going to miss. I was like, all right. Thanks. So, Would, wouldn't change something. Yeah. So we changed like maps now? or? Uh, yeah, so now uh, Dadding gets to pick any map. Well, any legal map with no counter pick. And then he I'll will right. go pick and ban first. Okay. okay. They're quite unsure about the maps. <coughs> you know where he's gonna know gonna go, Naz. <laughs> no, I think you better shut <laughs> shut your mouth, man. Don't don't like not getting it. <laughs> Should I pick enemies at the gate? <laughs> yeah, sure, go for it, man. I love it. Good, good, great map. That's uh, fantastic. My favorite map, man. <laughs> I can hear it. Mm. Um, I pick Skyford. Skyford. Okay. All right. And this one, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. All right. Three characters. Mutators. All right. All right. All right. Uh, oh, we ready. You still, mm -hmm. you, you still want those spawns, uh, Danny? You, you're okay. Yeah, with yeah. I'm fine. I'm fine. Yeah. That's the the short map, right? Very close one. Yeah. Ah, uh, mm -hmm. well, it's like the 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 for Joy Arena. Mm -mm. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Yes. So I'm gonna ban. Mm. I don't know why they didn't just literally keep the like aesthetic of the Poor Joy Arena. Like it would have been cool. Like actually, how it looks like, you know. <laughs> it's pretty dark in the Poor Joy. I actually like this one, to be honest. Yeah, they're both nice. Both nice. Shiny, bright, and the blood spills there and there. Like, oh, nice. There come. I have an owl. Arho, huh? Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Red Echo Band. Red Echo? No, right. Uh -huh. I'm picking Lowell. Mm hmm. I pick two now, right? Yep. yep. Mm. Mm. Tough choice, tough choice, very tough choice, very tough choice. Mm. Lohar is scary indeed. He's very scary. Alright, I think I'm gonna pick. Hmm. Wait one sec. Alright, I'm gonna pick our hoe. Oh, yeah. oh, he, oh yeah, he's bad. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Jesus. yeah. I was like all right. Oh shit! I picked two. I picked three. <laughs> I picked three of them. <laughs> oh no! Fuck! Disqualified. Yeah. He's breaking the rules. He's caught. <laughs> Bet you didn't expect that, huh? <laughs> I was like, wait, is is Arhu didn't like? Wasn't he banned? I was like, nah. There's like, why he? Why is he not banned? I was like, oh yeah, he is banned. He is banned. Yeah. Mm, okay. Can you Let's power see. infusion other people's summons? Mm, I don't think so, because it's mostly oh. incarnate. I think. Yeah, it's only incarnates. Yeah. I think you can power fusion as a kind of. Alright, I'm gonna go with. Uh... Shit, why am I so slow? Give me Niles. What? And give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Give me Sahela. 
Wow. Okay. Mm. Okay. Tuck and melody. <clears throat> <laughs> no hesitation there. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Melody, your favorite? Uh, no. Uh, listen. Uh, no, no, not my favorite. Mm. Okay, let's see. The last one. The last one. The last one. The last one will be the last one. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, then. Oh, what? Then, good luck. Good luck, man. Good luck. Okay, right, man. I'm gonna defend myself. Yeah, have a good one. Alrighty. It's a bit sad that, like, if we have to be in the same lobby as them, we can't commentate the actual draft because I think it's a really like interesting part of uh, of the of the game when it comes yeah. to competition. But uh, the way it's currently set up, uh, we can't do that too well. Um, is there a way to watch someone's stream without being in the channel? Not really, eh? I don't think so. Uh, not to my knowledge. Uh, it's, it's kind of... Yeah, I don't, I'm not really sure of a good fix to that. But, oh well. Steam Steam streaming. We'll, we'll have to set up, like, everyone... We'll make, like, a top six group and have everyone from the top six in a Steam group and then... We can set it up there. Like a Steam chat. He's going in with Niles. Okay, no, he's going up. He's going to get Source. Oh, he's... Oh, okay, interesting. And it break... Oh, that didn't break his armor, though. I was like, will that break Tarkin's armor right away? It's not quite. It's still good enough to uh, be able to pull some shenanigans with CC. Hmm. I, I, it might be that they just ran out of things to do, and it's like, oh, well, I'm playing Niles, so <laughs> yeah. the nade. I'll do that, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I don't know how much of a fan I am of this map, because it is kind of just high ground camping. Uh, yeah, what I really hate is that... Um, well, I always play P1 because I host, and too many times I've tried flanking on the side... And the hitboxes there are so you can you can find cracks through every, like you don't see yeah. it now, but you see like at the top right, like all those pillars. Yeah, you, you, you can, can shoot, you can through, shoot through, through that no problem. Thing. You can shoot everything through that. Oh my god, what is he doing? Is he suiciding Malady? Um, oh, he's teleporting. I would. Want that that sounds like a Malady that's going to be in big trouble very soon. That's a Sahila that can just walk away. I think I don't know how he's going to lock her down. Yep. Uh, he's flying after. Well, he her. does. He does have both of his guys' turns because he delayed. So now Gareth is going to walk in as well. Oh, he just, um, yeah, he's just going to go for a knockdown here. Besides that, ouch. he likes the engage. Uh, we're going to see maybe an in web. From uh, no, he goes for a backstab. I think he's committed too much. Um, I, I mean, I would just end web. No, you, you go. Saying. You got to go for the uh, in web. Yeah. You gotta go for the discount Niles. Oh, uh, you gotta but go Sahila the... is uh, Sahila is actually in trouble here. He can chicken her right off the yeah. bat. That's not good. Oh my god, please chicken her. Chicken her? Yeah. It is it is yeah, it is worth noting that Gareth doesn't do any fucking damage, so compared yeah. to Lohar, so this uh is a lot better of an engagement for Considering today. that this was gonna happen to Sahila, I think Gareth was better off spending that two AP to like fortify and mend. Um, to prevent that Definitely. from happening, um, because that's like several turns lost for Sahila if she's not dead, whereas he saved Tarkin from doing what really like summoning a totem and a bone widow or something, which is good, but. Let's to go in. He has no source. He's gonna sucker. No sucker punch. Interesting. That was quite curious. I'm very surprised by this. I can't tell if Tarquin's on team red or if he's just bleeding his like 
<laughs> Got so. <laughs> uh, if he were to drop it in a web here, it could be really nasty. Going you could it. do like in web smoke, and then they can't see anything or move. Oh, that's pretty oh. clever, actually. Ooh. And then he in webs. Yeah. Oh, that's that's jank. I find it, um, he can, yeah, he can, uh, do some funny stuff here. Unfortunately, uh, I, I believe in web removes all your evasion, so he can't use it in canny. It removes 60%. So, 60%? So, yeah, so in canny becomes kind of just like a blind. Wow, that's tough. Can he get himself out? Uh, the game won't let him, unfortunately. Uh, what ability is that? Guardian yeah. Angel. That, that, that... That might save the day, honestly. But it, the, the chicken might run out, though, that's the thing. <laughs> he should definitely just fortify and mend now, please do that. He mends, and then he's Ooh. gonna hopefully fortify uh, Sahila there. Yep. And then that's a healer. Hopefully lives now. Although the the ruptured tendons is piercing damage, right? So it can go right through. What uh? What nades does Tarquin have? He has terror and cluster. Uh, cursed fire. It actually deals like around seven. Like it's it's random, so it's a bit weird. But I'd say a, 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 like at a normal character, it's gonna deal around maybe like seventy magic damage. Wow, this is pretty funny. Yeah. <laughs> He's got uh, Naz cornered in his own side of the map. Like, the Tarkin can basically take Naz's high ground now. It's empty. Oh. Acid. Or curls a touch. Chicken mm -hmm. is smart. I guess he's referring to the fact that uh, it's not. It didn't move at all. Oh uh, yeah, he, he replayed sadly. So I guess yeah, it just passed it turn. It's turn. Yeah. I I think. I honestly think it has to do something with opportunity attack because Bone yeah, Widow has the Bone the Widow has it. That's the thing. I think putting the yeah. Bone Widow there was actually bad for him because yeah. it Empiric hunger makes the yeah. yeah. Two turns of disarm would be pretty nice. However, Sahela has two escape options. She is actually quite good. So, and that guardian angel is really messing everything up. Uh, however, getting the double and web is going to be quite nice. Oh, it's not moving, and it's still getting hit. What the f what? <laughs> it just like, huh? Huh? <laughs> I guess it like micro stepped or something. Ah, that's really weird. I mean, it was making the movement animation and everything. It just was not. Moving. I guess it, it was kind of like just moving in place. That's really. I wonder weird. what caused that. What that. But that is that puts uh, Naz at a really really rough spot. Yeah, I mean, he lost a healer, that was his carry, so I don't know how he's going to ever have the damage to deal with any of that. Uh, I would be tempted to just call GG here if I were him, but maybe... Uh. Reflection. Yeah. Now he can do funny stuff with Tarquin.
Oh, right, you can do that. I keep forgetting yeah. you can do that, of course. Oh, what the? What? <laughs> this game is cursed. Um. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what to say. I, I really don't know what to say. I, I, I think that... I don't think it should make that game invalid, but some really weird shit happened. Yeah. Wait, with all the blood that's around, I don't... Well, I guess maybe the high ground bonus is better. I was gonna say, with all the blood that's around, you know, you can summon some blood totems instead. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I mean, it's it's yeah, it's physical. That's a well placed uh, explosion. The repair metal is really, or men metal is really carrying here. They're just keeping Niles alive, even though he really shouldn't be. Yeah, Niles is actually fairly healthy, right? Gareth might get his shields up eventually. It's just, I mean, I'm never too sure what to expect from a Niles. If he can get his smoke off, like, smoke is so unpredictable that you're not sure what would happen, but he does not have swords, so I just don't understand what he's supposed to do here, honestly. Is he still in the web? No. Is he? He is. <laughs> just spamming the, uh, the back slash button. Oh. I missed. missed. Oh, I, I was going to say... <laughs> he got robbed there, but uh, the uncanny evasion is what happened. Yeah. I'll go for the uh, knives. But I am not him. And the atrophy is probably better. Oh, wait, you can't knives because of the, uh, the shackles of pain. Uh oh. Does Gareth have anything left? I don't think so. I mean, you certainly carried this match in keeping his party somewhat alive, but... Yeah, but it so was much. just... Sahila getting chicken there. There were just like... Uh, nope. nope. I do wonder what would have happened if he, uh, he didn't get killed, or Sahela didn't get killed by the Rupture Tendons, Jank. Because he could have definitely gone high ground and then... Yeah, if, if she survived for one turn, then you just cloak and, yeah. and you, you just jump away and cloak and then you can do whatever. Yeah. And then you kill Tarquin in one turn at some point. The game kind of opens up again. Um she's just living on the edge. I don't know why he's even if if Tarquin doesn't get knocked or die like in the next turn or something, it's already pretty much over, but I think he's considering the uh infect so he can just kill Gareth right away, but it might infect Lohar as well. But hmm. I won't I'm kind of confused by that play. Oh, oh, never mind. Just kill him. <laughs> they killed the blood oh, totem. Killed the totem bag. That's funny. Oh, um, he was worried about the reflect. I think. Oh maybe yeah, that's why yeah. He didn't yeah. want to infect. He was like, "Oh shit, I might kill myself for that." Because uh, infect is in fact a projectile. Yeah. Somehow. I I've gotten screwed over a couple times when I play necromancer. Uh, wow. By that. By people having yeah. shield them. That's funny. I think the game's won. Um, it's not really. Much. I, I, I think it's pretty straightforward here. Yeah. That was a weird lineup. Gareth, Niles, and Sahila. Really don't know what the the plan was. Yeah. Oh, he's thinking a lot, isn't he? Yeah. He, just... he end turn. 
Oh, he's he's worried about the shackles of pain, but I seriously think, like, Niles is kind of... Maybe there's some tech that I don't know of, but it, at least when I play with my friends, Niles is kind of a meme. Yeah. Um, it's just, yeah, it's just not as good as Lohar, unfortunately. Yeah, it's it's unbelievable to think that it can even be compared when you like they're both supposed to be assassins, you know, but Yeah. He's gonna go for the uh infect and hope that his necromancy carries him. It does not. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean that's a weak and why would he do that though? That makes literally no sense. I, I think he was hoping that because uh, Tarquin should have like five necromancy or something, right? And usually killing blows, if you, like, kill yourself on something, but have necromancy, it heals you back. I'm just not sure what happened. Well, the game's over anyways, so. Maybe you just wanted to end it. Alright. Alright. We're going to a game three. Yay, cool. we get a game GG, three. man. GG. GG. Oh yeah, my GG. god, that's it. Heal up, uh. blew up. That was a weird thing with a chicken. Yeah, yeah, yeah as a, was, to be honest, so the first turn was weird because it didn't move, and the second turn, it didn't move, but it got damaged. It was slightly yeah. weirder. I, but, yeah. But um, we, we we saw the animation running, so I'm thinking maybe it was just like sort of micro-stepping in place. Um, maybe. Like sort of to move, but to avoid the, the attack of opportunity somehow. So I don't know, like... To what extent it's it's better that it happened that way or not, but it was definitely weird. The blob also yeah. just spawning miles away from the corpse was pretty weird. Too. Uh, this was because of the spider. Um, the hitbox overlapping, so the oh, spider wow. didn't respawn when it was spawning, so the, the blob spawned near the hitbox of the spider. Oh, okay. And yeah. then the spider despawned. Uh, it's alright with, with it. That's mm. pretty janky, to be honest, because you yeah. think yeah. that it would despawn the spider first, and then... Yeah, but the... The game is just like, spawn, yeah. spawn this one. Oh wait, you already have a summon. Delete the other one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So, what is it like now? Who's banning what? Who's picking what? Um. Uh, you get to pick the map you want, and you ban and pick first. Yes. Uh, can we pick the same map we played before? Uh, you cannot pick a map that you won on. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Actually, I'm not sure if that's well specified in the rule set. Hmm. Well, I mean... En enemies, enemies in front of the gate are still... Yeah, thanks. Uh, let's play Sky <laughs> Skyfort. Between two, I picked Skyfort, yeah. Okay. So Skyfort again. Mm -hmm. Let me just get ready. All right. Yeah. Yeah, fuck Lohart. It's good that I was banning him all the time. Fuck Lohart. Yeah. To be honest, in game one, I was gambling that you didn't pick to pick will pick him. Mm -hmm. I wanted to do the same like I did in game two in the first game. This mm. was a bit unlucky. Yeah, that's why melody. Mm. So um, my burn. Yeah, Aru. Aru, huh? Don't want to play against him. Mm -hmm. And I pick now, or you pick? Uh, you you pick one and then I pick uh -huh. the next two and, and then, then you, you pick two. him. Just like a, any mobile game. Mm -hmm. and... mm. Wait, I want to check one thing. That's... Sure. No, 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 yeah, like, take no, your no, time. No. Uh, I'm not in a, in a rush. <clears throat> 16, 19. Hmm. Oh, I see. All right. Hmm. I think it's kind of dangerous to pick it, actually, to be honest. To be honest, it's very dangerous. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go with Tarquin. Tarquin? Oh, right. Yeah. 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 I see. 
To be honest, I think Tarquin is a very, very good character. Oh yeah, he's insane. He has the totems, he has the summons, a bit yeah. of support with it. Uh, yeah, I like him. Yeah. <laughs> so, um... Now my turn. Um, I will pick Slane and Sandalo. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Sandalor, huh? Mm -hmm. Hmm. Quite tempting, obviously. Quite tempting. <laughs> Quite tempting. Who are we talking about? Is there someone tempting that wasn't banned? <laughs> Triple R who, here we go. Uh, <laughs> yeah. nice. That's oh, right. no. My only yeah. true counter. You need why, to ban why, why three times, otherwise you still get, uh, <laughs> you still get yeah. two if you only ban him once. <laughs> but but why draft uh, three people when you can draft six, you know? Yeah, uh -huh. six are who, here we go. <laughs> and everyone got the incarnate. Yeah, Ian, just... Ian and Caleb have done it, I think. It must have been nasty. <laughs> three for all incarnate. Oh my god. Oh, there yeah. it goes, there it goes. Yes. And one more, mm -hmm. huh? One more. Who is the one more dude? What I want to get? What, what were the the bands? Sorry, I, I was uh, I missed a little bit. Uh, I went low. Yeah. Okay. And one more. Huh? Hmm. Hmm. Is that what I want? Uh. Yeah, you can unpick and still think about it a little can bit. Can I unpick? Yeah, yeah, go for it, go for it. No. Uh, I don't know why I picked them. It's kind of weird. Kind of bad choice. Kind of bad choice. Hmm. Bad choice indeed. What map are we on? Uh, uh, same, same one. Again. Yeah, same one. Oh, okay. Yeah. Same map, same map. No chapel this time, unfortunately. Yeah. Nope. That's the way. I don't know, mm. I think I don't like chapel so much. I like it a lot. I... Yeah. To be honest, I don't know what to do with the space between the two spawns. Yeah, that's Jeez. why you yeah. look at the portals. <laughs> yeah, true, true. <laughs> Ooh, Lucian. Made my pick. Oh, wow. Okay. Lucian. What are the skills? Interesting. And I need to stop thinking. Like when I'm not thinking, it's much better. Just click, <laughs> click, click, and it always works out much better than I'm just sitting stalling, freaking picking the stuff. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's my uh, that's my strat as well. Uh -huh. <laughs> I was uh -huh. doing this whole time, and now I'm just like, what yeah. am I doing? For me, I have to think. Otherwise, uh, I heal myself when I'm dizzy. Uh, when I'm when I'm uh, whatever what it's called. Mm. Wait, what yeah. is it? I go Decaying. by the cuff. I, I, do, I do shit like that when I don't think. Okay. Let's go. All right. All right. Good luck, man. Let's go. Have Let's a, go, man. Have a good, good last match. Let's go. Yeah, you do, man. Yeah. All right. So, this is pretty, um, I'm not really sure what uh, Naz's draft is supposed to be. Rideka has disgusting openings on this map, so I, I think he's going to get... Kind of cheesed yeah. again. Uh, again with the Lucian pick. I, I don't understand. I mean, he's a very good player when you look at how he... I, I, I don't know. He, he, doesn't, he doesn't want to think. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean... He has, he's having fun. He, he's, he's got the cool fun. aura around him. That's one thing. Oh, yeah. It's for the, very for the, for the bling bling. The delays. Oh, he decides to delay. Wow, I wouldn't do that, but that's cool. On this map, high ground and positioning are just incredibly uh, game-winning. So, 
to pick triple characters that don't have any um, form of repositioning is going to be really, really tough. Yeah. Especially because um, the Ding's lined up has two teleports. And we have no... Yeah, he hesitated about picking Alexander, but the Fortify would have been really... He, at least he could have fortified the Lucian so he doesn't get teleported away if he goes in. Yeah. <laughs> that would have been a start. Wait, what is he up to? Oh, he's going up. I would have just blobbed Yeah, He has to that. go high ground or else he's going to get teleported. Uh, I guess so. Decides to, oh, that's, that's, that's really, really smart, actually. He decides to go for a slow. Um... So they're gonna you can be... heal it off while uh, rubber banding. <laughs> <laughs> well, he had an explanation for the blob at least. That that explains some stuff. Well, actually, this is pretty rough for Zandalor. You gotta spend all the all this time walking his fat butt out, <laughs> up the ladder. Yeah. I do you think him going to high ground was actually that necessary? Yeah, actually, uh, definitely, the... because that saves him from the blob combo. That's why I would have definitely blob yeah. comboed while... Oh, but he... the blob can go up ladders, I think. That blob can go up ladders. Yeah. Uh, I, I think the, the combo is still really strong, though, or, or much stronger if you, you know, get them in place rather than having to walk. Yeah, but right now, Redeka and, uh, you know, it's just he's going to hit two different targets instead. Uh, and if I were him, I would actually prefer to hit Redeka and... Uh, Vandalore, I think, than, than Slain. What is that that he's, uh, Lucian is trying to cast? I'm, I don't I've got no it's well. idea. Oh, wait, he also has a blob? No, he is. Or no, he scroll. used the blob from J. I don't, I, don't re I really don't understand this this, this, yeah. this idea. Like, I guess he wants to save. I, I've got no idea. I've got no yeah. idea. The turn if order, I was him, I would have definitely Phoenix dived and then gone right up in those two mages' faces. I don't know how strong Lucian is in melee, but... It, it would be suicide, because he would be across the map alone, and then he would just get frozen. Yeah. Like, if you, look at their, if you look at their team, they have uh, water, water, lightning, lightning. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. So, right. it's... Let's... It's the part where uh, you bring out the fire whip and you fire whip yourself to cause burning, so you can't be frozen. I don't think he can actually. <laughs> I don't even think he can actually do that, sadly. <laughs> yeah. Or you have Jayhan like fireball you. <laughs> <laughs> he can just. I I actually. Uh, this is really. Thought about play. those things. Jayhan can set the fire status because of torture, so he can just auto attack people easily. Uh, if it's oh, you just, can, yeah. Yeah, if, if it's just to remove su such statuses, you could really just like unequip a wand to deal minimal damage and just like set like fire on, yeah. on whoever. I'm kind of confused as to why he uh, walked instead of just like flew onto high ground. Because it has a one turn cooldown. Um, there's nothing stopping Yeah, him. there's no Maybe reason to walk in. Maybe it was site issues, or maybe he was running out of time. Um, Tarquin is going to have a similar issue. I, he might be going for just like chip totem place because his opponent does not have any summon to fight back with. Correct. Yeah. Yeah, I was like, yeah. this game is looking really bad for for Naz, and I'm like, why? Because he does have like freaking Tarquin and 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 Jehan, so. He has very strong picks. It's just Lucian. We're gonna have to see how the Lucian comes in. Um, this is very strange. Uh, he's using the side blocker, which is nice. Um, but one interesting thing that could happen though is if he resurrects Tarquin, he can uh, living on the edge himself, like right on the spot. What did he just cast? Nothing. He, he Nothing. Okay. Out. I thought. Um, there, are, are there any corpses over there? Because it'd be really interesting. I, I'm not really sure what Tarquin's uh, ultimate source spell is. So, uh, the ultimate source is like the it makes a little to like bone totem next to every character. Oh, oh, the the necro totems. Yeah, I've. Uh, yeah. I don't know. I tried it once and it seemed kind of underwhelming, but I I think it yeah. must be. It must be strong. It's just. 
I feel like if you get to set that up, usually you already won. <laughs> yeah. I feel like... Luton blocked by physical armor. <laughs> oh, and he goes again because of... Uh... It's only been turn one, actually. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're taking their time thinking a lot. Um, one hard to deal with that blob combo. Well, that blob did nothing. I don't know. I, I don't see any reason why he would have held on to it. I think he just maybe doesn't quite... He hasn't really done the blob combo before. He hasn't really seen it. Maybe. I think, I think he's just going to chuck rocks at uh, Slane. <laughs> That's fine, honestly. Oh, wow. Even better. Had Zandalor really oh, wow. he... hit there. I wasn't I guess he aware could that. Of it. I, I guess he was looking for those pixels there. I wasn't aware that that would actually connect. Yeah. Now the ding's going to look for the same pixels. If his Jahan can land there. Um, oh, but the, the magic armor is definitely pretty smart here. He went to the grenade. Um, the thing, though, is that. And this is a really powerful part is. Um, you, you have these AoE spells, so. Have. Uh, Hiding behind the shot blocker is not too much of a big deal. Mm -hmm. um, there is the issue that Tarquin is pretty sturdy in magic armor, so it's not going to accomplish much. But now he's slowed as well. Shift role de tornado. <laughs> I don't think there's any point in doing anything else. I think you just no. Oh, well, the uh, the curse of oil was a pretty good idea though, if he had gotten that out. What does it do anyways? I thought it was pretty similar to just regular oil. Uh, if you walk, it cause is a chance to cause an explosion. Oh yeah, it might explode. True. Yeah. So uh, if Tarquin tries to move at all because he doesn't have any mobility spells, he just uh dies. Or he doesn't die, but he takes a lot of damage. Mm -hmm. Hey, uh, just popped in. Is uh, what uh, what round are we in? It feels like they just started a match here. Uh, uh, this, this is, is game the, three. This is the tiebreaker, actually. Uh, we've had some pretty intense matches. We had a very boss oh, grenade. Sorry. <laughs> Wait, what grenade was that? I, I believe it was a cluster nade. Um, yeah, it was a, the the curse one because there's the back fire everywhere. That's that's early to use a grenade. That's interesting. Although I believe, oh, Ooh. they had no magic. You have a double oh, panic off. Oh, I like it. God, so... that was huge. I am certainly pogging right now. Oh, I am pogging so hard right now. Lucian Gaming, let's go. <laughs> Lucian Gaming, the cluster nade of a lifetime, unbelievable. Because because I was gonna say like they can still walk into the little bit of blessed ice that exists there, and then he got rid of it. Uh, recover a little bit. Yeah. So it's not a game breaker. Um. No, he's, he's going to go for the sun. Though. Yeah. I don't think a... Lucian matters all that much anymore. He blew his combo, you know? Well, yeah, he used somebody else's grenades. <laughs> no, <laughs> it like, looks like he, uh, uh, Daddy's team nothing. has a lot of armor still. Has uh, Poppy not used... Or not Poppy. Uh, Naz not used the bone uh, corpse yet? Uh, I don't think he has. No. Uh, I don't... Yeah, I don't think I've seen anything from Tarquin, really. Yeah, he hasn't done much at all. I guess he might have a lot of AP right now, honestly. I don't know uh, how much he's It's worth noting, there. though, that Tarquin's kind of useless, <laughs> useless right now, because uh, uh, everything is magic oh. armor right now. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, I don't know how much AP he has left. He has to be careful about getting teleported, though. If he decides to stay out there... Um, go for... Oh no, but they're both they're both feared, so he actually has a completely free turn. He doesn't have uh, to to worry about anything except maybe Slane jumping in, but Oh, and he <laughs> picks up a source while being feared. Let's go. <laughs> well, and uh walks I I'm not entirely sure if from that position you can get hit. I believe so. Uh that's really rough though. I, I... So okay. yeah, I, I think so. I think I think he should be able to land something on her from here. An interesting thing about delaying turns is that if you get CC'd, 
then it skips over both the delayed turn and your next turn, I think. Yes, I found that out the hard way, and I am very not happy about that interaction, to be honest. That that seems a little jinky to me, yeah. but uh, I know that that's just kind of how the game works for now. Yeah, like... um. What's his face? In my game three against the ding. Um, oh, wow, uh, that crescendo. That's amazing. Oh, gosh. Oh. I, I, I love watching Nas sometimes. Sometimes it's just like, why is he doing this? It's so, so like, not meta and, and just seems silly. And sometimes it doesn't work. But then sometimes he just pulls, like, this freaking Lucian going in with grenades. And then it just all made sense. It just all worked out so well. It's it's just he's he's thinking, like, on his own... Like, he's actually not thinking. That's what's. Uh, that's what he says. That's what he says. But clearly, he is like that. That that had some planning to it. I think. Um. I wonder if Tarquin has hope silencing. Uh, I I hope so. Otherwise, this is a super risky move bringing Tarquin out in the open like that. He's gonna bring out the elemental. Uh, oh wow! Okay. Uh, I have to go for a big guy. Sorry about that. No That's okay. We'll we'll cover the the commentary for now. Yeah. I'm really excited to see what uh, Batting's going to do with Radica because she still has most of her abilities. Looks like all it's missing is raining blood and teleport, <laughs> and they're both going to be up very soon. The uh, the issue that he's going to run into here is that. He Radeka is in a terrible position, and she's going to die soon. Uh, That's true, but he can move up that 1 AP, which is what he's going to do just to get the stun off on Tarkin, which is going to be very helpful, because locking down Tarkin while he has no magic armor uh, and no way to recover is going to be pretty helpful. Yeah. So Tarkin's just kind of caught out in the open here, and there's really no nothing defensive that Naz has by the looks of it. Jayhan's still a pretty powerful presence. I'm not really sure. Um, because he can still auto-attack pretty strong. Um, That's true. Has uh, Jahan picked up any source yet? Can he drop down that fire slug? Uh, he already did, I believe. Oh, wait, no, no, no. He he has not. Sorry. Uh, but he has also not gotten any source. I believe there's a body on the left that he hasn't seen. Okay, uh, but you I mean, do. I'll also pay on who has... Uh, I actually just killed Radica, he so is really he should have Radica. Source now, right? Oh yeah, he did. I don't... I didn't... Oh, well, I guess he might. We'll have to see. Um... I'm not sure about this play. If he's setting up the Omega Icebreaker here, this could be really, really strong. Yeah, I mean, Lucian's frozen, so Slane's up next, and if Slane has Icebreaker up, this is going to be a real big hit. Now, I think he can't quite hit Slane with that uh, Soothing Cold, so I think he's going to have to walk through the fire a little bit if he wants to get Soothing Cold on both of them. Yeah. Lucian is frozen, right? He's, yeah, he's frozen 100%. Okay, uh... Oh yeah, here comes the. Oh please, use icebreaker. I would love to see that. He's probably nutting in his microphone right now, like. <laughs> oh yeah, here it comes. Ooh. Oh, that was so good. Got the Lucian kill. So now just be careful because now uh, the scroll is going to be available. Honestly, what I would do here is I would walk up and loot the scroll and then use it on Rebecca. I don't know if that would be the best play, but let's be honest, it would be the funniest play. Yeah. Is he going to curse him? Well, Jahan is crippled and has no... Oh, okay. He chose not to curse. I still think using up that AP to take the scroll would have been worth it. Uh, kind of disappointed we didn't get to see that, but I think Danny's in a really good spot here. I think the game is uh, over, actually. <laughs> uh, I, I might be preemptively calling this, but you can. Yeah, he has all. He has Zandalore in high ground with all of his. Yeah, spells. and he has the the freeze off, and now uh, Rike or not Rike Tarkin's wet, so this could be the end. And he. Uh, 
Yeah, he's just going for that chain CC. He's gonna. I don't think he's gonna be able to quite. Yeah, he can't quite kill off uh, Jahan here. And curse him for the. Uh, well, then update. Oh, well, maybe. Yeah, no, I think it's a it. decaying. Yeah, you can see it's decaying and stunned. So Jahan's got nothing to do here. Uh, I think the better play would be going after Riker. Or, yeah, Tarquin. Uh, yes, thank you. I don't know why I keep getting him mixed <laughs> up. Uh, they appear in the same area of the game, I suppose, yeah. Yeah, the game is over. Next turn he gets uh, Icebreaker and he dies horribly. Wow, I am kind of surprised. Uh, I was really... That was a huge, huge comeback. Vegan's gonna like come back and be like, what the fuck happened here? <laughs> Oh, I know that was that GG, was more than fuck oh, GG, the ice man. breaker Lord. plays, man. <laughs> uh, that ice, one ice fucking me? explosion did fucking yeah. bazillion damage. Was yeah, it's insane. so strong. I, I really yeah, like a so round of applause color. to you, Dadding. That was some great gameplay. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, yeah. good GG, man. Uh, GG. To be honest, Congrats. if you didn't move uh, Jaha from the high court, yeah. I think you would have won. Yeah, I think that was a mistake. Yeah, yeah. That, that's the thing. Like, well, well, otherwise, them. I couldn't port him, and then I could chance to see them all to death. Yeah, it's like the. I thought like you have one more turn cooldown on the teleportation, so I just bet it on that. I never used it. I, I used it on Radiska. Ah, uh, shit. Well, here you go, man. Yeah, yeah and plus, but, didn't you just kill Radica? Well, I'm surprised you didn't throw it on the fire slug when you had the chance yeah, to yeah. distract him and do a lot of damage. Mm. I wanted to use the fire slug, but then I was like, maybe I need to rush it because I lost all my range ability. So Jayhan, I, I thought that he used it on Zandalor and he's going to TP me later, so I had to rush it. So, so well, mm -hmm. mistake yeah. is a mistake. But so GG anyways. was a nice series. Yeah, very, yeah. very close. GG man, GG. Congrats. <clears throat> thank you. Yeah. Good luck in the future tournament. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah.